were on location as such at Loop Head, but we have all of the partners in the brand uh, with us from right around the coast. So we're delighted to have everybody represented. As part of our research into the future opportunities for lighthouse tourism, we had a really, really good interactive session today where the people who are attending this conference got their opportunity to share their vision for the future. So a lot of working in community, networking together, the strength in partnerships, but also looking out there to see some iconic examples around the world. What I learned today, I suppose, was the power of the collective. Because that's what we're about, is a collective vision. And it's all about how we can work together how, can, how two and two can make five. We're looking to see how lighthouses can support our mission to make Northern Ireland a destination of choice across the world, but also how can we support them to be the best that they can be. My biggest take home from today is probably the shared challenges across the island for people who are working in lighthouses and looking to develop experiences at lighthouses, but also the shared opportunities that we have. You know, we all need to work together and create this real exciting opportunity for people to come and see, you know, how wonderful these places are. The big takeaway is how the partnership and the strength in partnership and how we can work really well together. I'm very excited by the shared energy across the partnership and the network. We're learning from each other. That's the huge importance of these events, taking learnings uh, and I suppose working from experiences that, that each of us uh, have found from our individual locations around the island. So much for us to explore in this network. Our lighthouses are the most incredible sites. There are such rich stories here and there are so many possibilities that the future is really exciting. From a Landmark Trust perspective, I'm really interested in strengthening those connections across the network and how we can look to really tie ourselves into that sustainability piece. I think that what we've been doing as a charity has always been very sustainable in our approach to saving the buildings, but actually how do we really share that story and how do we really spread that sustainability out in a, a wider way across the whole offer. Our vision in Irish Lights has been to develop the lighthouses uh, with a view to obviously ensuring that the heritage is protected uh, and maintained for the future, for future generations, and to do that in a way which stimulates economic development in local communities. It's about really having collective vision for great lighthouses of Ireland. And I feel we had that today because everybody's, and we think big, you know, we think, you know, 20 years time, what is, what's going to be happening at the lighthouse? And that's the kind of vision that I'm very, very honoured to lead. We did a lot of brainstorming this morning on some fantastic, weird and wonderful ideas for how we can develop tourism at the lighthouses that range from virtual aquariums to looking at lighthouses from different angles, be that cliff walks on boats. I just think the opportunities are endless and it's really exciting how we can look to use local people, local skills and develop it for the future. What we want to be able to achieve is spreading the benefits of tourism across communities, across the seasons, across the counties. What I took away was the tremendous enthusiasm of the group, the ideas that were forthcoming, the willingness to work together, and I suppose overall that we can be truly iconic here in Ireland. We are of local communities. Irish Lights is very much an organisation which is on the coast, has been on the coast for very many years. We may not have light keep, lighthouse keepers now, uh, but we are still part of the community and we want to ensure that the lighthouses go on giving to the community. So what we can do is we can ensure that they still function as aids to navigation right now today uh, but in addition to that they also function as uh, opportunities for economic uh, development and sustainable development experiences. We're only at the start of a journey which has great potential.